the end of April and this is the last of the spring drillings. It was drilled two weeks ago and these fields sometimes attract the crows. I had a couple of decent bags here last year. There are some crows on the fields and they seem keen to be here. There are three fields in the area, all next door to each other, and the crows just seem to be hopping from field to field. As I thought, there are some crows on the brow of this hill. There definitely seems to be two very distinct flight lines, one coming along this hedge here and one coming from the woods behind me. Now I need to go away and think of a plan of action for tomorrow morning. Well I've decided to set up in field three with the hide on the brow of the hill with my decoys just out in front of me. This way the two flight lines should come straight to the decoys and I'm going to place a bird scarer into the other two fields. This way I've also got the sun at my back but fortunately I will have the wind straight in my face. Bird scarers that I've placed out in the other fields simply a piece of tinsel on a wire coat hanger attached to a stick. Quite simple but very effective at keeping the birds off. Arrived at 5 o'clock this morning, set the decoys up, very strong wind blowing with uh, rain showers forecast for most of the day. Let's see what happens.
started off the day with four frozen crows and I've just added to them as I went. It's a random pattern, but that hole in the pattern has been key. All the crows have tried to land in that hole. This has allowed me a nice killing zone.